I'm Nikki and I'm going to be bringing you a series of tutorials with the Outside Lives Revival Project. The Revival Project is all about reusing things that would otherwise go to landfill and making stuff that's really useful and practical. I'm filming today in the new and very awesome Outside Lives office. So here we go. Today I'm going to be making a dishwashing scrubby thing, a scourer. So here we go. Right, so you're going to need quite a few of these um, orange nets that I've been saving up and everybody's been giving me. And what you need to do is you need to cut off the, obviously cut off the, um, the labels and the tags. And you need one with fairly, fairly large-ish holes to get your needle through that is still pretty much intact. So you need it to be a full tube with no holes in it. So you just cut off the ends. Now on one end, you can do this with string, but I prefer to use a piece of the net. So what you'll do is just cut a strip of the net. Like so. Thread it into a needle with a large eye if you can. And just stitch it backwards and forwards through the holes. It doesn't have to be every hole. And just do it flat like that. Pull it through. and tie it a couple of times just to make it really secure. Cut off the ends, or pull off the ends. And then you just stuff it with some of the nets. Now you don't want to stuff it too hard. This is quite firm, but it's still got a bit of sponginess left to it. And once you think you've got it about the right size, I think that's about enough. Get another strip of mesh. And just do what you did at the other end. If you get it quite close to where you don't want it too tight, you want to make sure they're all tucked in, but just do it just above where you've stuffed it. Just stitch in and out. And tie it tight. Cut the excess off and there you have a scourer. Fab. I, I think it takes about probably eight to ten to make one of these so if you eat a lot of oranges you will soon have enough to make one. Okay thank you. See you next time. <laughs>